and down, man. Give me like, some. Uh, injuries have happened. You know, different stuff has happened throughout the course of the year. You know, a lot of us, you know, me, Josh, and Wendell were in the G League for, to begin the year. I didn't know if I'd ever be be up for the season. So to get a chance to be up and, and have those opportunities come, you know, you just like, keep working every day. Um, Joe Boylan, our, our player, How long you been our right? director of player development, exactly. keeps us all ready and, uh, in multiple ways, staying shapely, different workouts, and uh, everyone, 1 through 17, is ready, no matter what night it is. And he got the baguettes. Okay. That boy got the baguettes in meatball. Coach Finch was talking about things that you were rushing a little bit, you know, once earlier in the season. Yeah. Have things just maybe started to slow down for you? For sure. You know, I, I think it's, it's a learning progress for me, just every day getting more and more. Uh, Opportunities within the rotation, and uh, you know, obviously, you know, there's there's a lot of things I can do. Uh, you know, not just score, I can create open shots for others by screening and you know, uh, using pick pulling the bigs out because I can shoot the ball, different stuff like that. And uh, you know, I'm just learning from the guys that we have here, learning every day, and you know, just trying to get better and be ready um, and prepared for any opportunity that comes my way. What was the just kind of energy like tonight when you, know, you have so many guys that aren't playing that normally do? guys winning opportunities and, and really stepping up. Was this kind of unlike any other game you've played this season? Yeah, I mean, it was definitely strange with, uh, you know, with everything going on, but you know, I think Jordan McLaughlin said it really well before the game started, just don't let them play hard on us and just focus on that. And that's what we did. We came out with energy and we had guys step up. And, uh, I really want to shout out Josh. You know, he's been so ready and he's working so hard in the G League this year. And, and to get an opportunity to get a double double and show what he can do, I'm just really proud of him. And that exemplified tonight just how hard he played. And everybody just went out there and played hard and played with energy. Luca, you play with so much passion. Where would you say that kind of competitor, that huge drive comes from? And have you always been that way, to just be so passionate on the floor? Yeah, I think, you know, part of it comes from the work and the preparation I've done my whole life. I have, I have a, a lot of confidence in my game uh, because of how many. I feel like I've worked harder than you know, anybody else, you know, especially to get here as a guy who's you know, labeled as unathletic and slow and whatever. Um, you know, it just fuels me to keep working. So, you know, I play with uh, play like that because I, you know, I love the game and I work hard at it. So, uh, to me, I just want to have fun. And, uh, you know, I don't want to ever look back in my time in the NBA and be like, you know, I didn't make the most of it. I didn't enjoy it while I was in it. It's my childhood dream. I think you lose sight of that sometimes, you know, with all the stress that happens in this league. You get the guys going with your scoring and all the different plays, but how much uh, have you focused on providing the energy, just even on the floor in different ways, but just your energy, like helping out the team in that I, way? Yeah, absolutely. I, I definitely want to, you know, uh, be known as, as you know, the energy guy that comes in, hustles, gets you know, loose balls, rebounds, tries to take a charge, um, does all the little things. And obviously, you know, I can score a ball too, but, you know, the, Scoring will come, you know, you'll miss shots, you'll make shots, but those energy plays, those hustle plays, you know, that, that can never leave. I have to play that way every game. I, I can't afford not to. I'm not athletic enough. Um, you know, to be able to do that, I can't uh, rely on, you know, just my athleticism. You know, it, it doesn't work out that, that way for me, and it's a blessing in disguise because uh, I just play harder than whoever lines in front of me. Where'd you get the shiner? When was that? Was that like uh, Jeff Green? I took the charge last night. He hit me one more at the end of the first quarter. Yeah. Brent Forrest says he did it, but that's a lie. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.